morning guys okay so this is what's happening right now this u-haul filled up most of our well a little bit just like three bedrooms full like you guys saw um we moved a like three bedroom worth of stuff out and um yeah so they did pretty good progress but yeah my dad bought the u-haul but we had so much china to where like we filled the whole thing and we still have other stuff that we have to move out of the house so it was pretty it was pretty crazy how much stuff they had um so yeah, um, now I'm actually at the store. I'm gonna get some stuff for like guacamole because I really want guacamole like really bad. And I have two like ripe um, avocados and I need to use that. So I'm just going to get some chips and tomatoes and all that. And then I'm gonna go back home and eat. Uh, I don't have work today, but I, have, I do have school at six. Um, so, yeah, I have to do that. But, yeah, my dad had already left to go um, to the new house or whatever. And then I guess after the new house, they have to go to San Clemente to where my stepmom lives. And they have to pack all that stuff up, too. So, that's pretty ridiculous. And I'm so glad I don't have to do that. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm going to go in right now. Okay, so I just got home, and this is what the house looks like. So, yeah. Um, all that stuff that was by the entertainment center is gone. They're actually going to take the entertainment center, but they're going to take it another time just because they wanted to get more stuff into the truck. Um, so, yeah, and then they're going to give this TV away that you guys see right there. Um, and then uh, this is a dining room. I just got done watching an 80s movie. You guys know how much I love 80s movies. So, it's called Mystic Pizza. I actually got it from um, this YouTuber. Her name's Jess. I forgot her last name. But, um, yeah, she recommended that Mystic Pizza was a really good movie. So, I wanted to watch it because I love 80s movies. And it's really good. So, if you guys haven't seen Mystic Pizza, definitely uh, check it out. It was my first time watching it. And it was a really good movie. So. Yeah, if you guys like those uh, lovey romance, well, it's not really a lovey romance. Um, it's about three best friends and their whole journey and stuff with like love, relationships, school, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, check it out. Hi guys. So I went to school today just to come find out that my class was canceled. <laughs> I was so burnt <laughs> and they didn't even have it on the site like where you see your cancel classes they didn't have it up there and they had they had it like on a sign in front of the class the in front of the door I got some Starbucks um, I had to relieve myself I haven't had Starbucks in a very long time it's been a while um, I can't even remember the last time I had Starbucks but I think I vlogged it the last time so I've been doing really good with the Starbucks. Um, but yeah, so right now I'm about to head home. I might edit the vlog because I have time. And then I have school at 12, my next class at 12. Hopefully it's not canceled and I don't go there um, for no reason. T today's events um, are going to be kind of cool. Um, I'm actually going to get a manicure. Um... Yeah, it started chipping, but it lasted two weeks. And you guys were saying that gel lasts two weeks. So, imagine if I got gel. It would last so much longer. But I think I'm just going to get my regular manicure. Because um, it's cheaper. And, I don't know. It, it's starting to chip and look crappy. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to get that done. I'm going to go with, well, my co-worker, actually. And then, um... After that, I'm going to film the haul today. I'm definitely going to film it today. Sigur! I'm definitely going to film it today. Because I have to. And I want to edit it and get it up. Um, I might get it up tonight. Like, at 12-ish. I'm not too sure. Just depends on um, what 
uh, I'm doing, which I'm probably not going to do much, um, so I'll probably get it up by tonight. Uh, so yeah, sorry I didn't film a video last week. Hi guys, I just got back um, from getting my nails done and I like the color, they're really pretty. I got a teal color, it was a China Glaze nail polish in. Yeah, I really like it. The reason why I wanted to get um, my nails done today is because I wanted to make sure my nails are good for the video because my nails were crappy yesterday. Oh well, this morning. So I just got them done and it felt so good. I got a massage too. I love getting massages. Like seriously, after I'm done getting a manicure, I feel so relaxed and I don't know, it just makes my day like a hundred times better. So yeah, after we went to go get our nails done, uh, my friend had to pick up her dog from the pound because uh, um, like someone um, on base found it. It was really sad. I went to go see the dogs that were getting adopted, well, that were trying to get adopted. It was the most depressing thing in the world because they look so sad, uh, they look so scared, and yeah, it was just really, it wasn't good at all. I don't like seeing, especially two older dogs, um, I know it's harder for them to get adopted, but there was one dog, and it was like 10 years old, almost, it was like a little bit blind, and uh, yeah, it was just sad to think that uh, someone like would give their dog for adoption after 10 years, you know, like it's just so sad and it looks so depressing and I don't know. And then there's another dog in the corner of like the, where they stayed at. It was like, I was trying to call the dog over, but it wouldn't even, it wouldn't even come to me. Like it was just really quiet in the corner and it was like a big dog and it was, I was just like, that's not normal at all. And just to think that they um, get put to sleep if they don't get adopted it's it's just really sad I didn't like it at all um and there are so many dogs in there like so many so that's why I'm thankful that I have my dogs they're healthy and I care for them so much you know um but honestly if you can't take care of a dog don't get one like I don't know it's so hard but it's really sad and depressing to see that um, but if my dogs are ever bad, I'm going to take them there and <laughs> make them see that they, they live the perfect life. Um, just kidding about that. But yeah, so right now I'm actually going to collect this stuff to start filming. And um, uh, there's a room right next to mine. I used to actually uh, like room in here when I first got here. Um, when I first lived with my dad, this is the first room that I lived in. And, um, yeah, it looks like this. It's empty now just because they cleared everything out. Um, but yeah, this is now my stepbrother's room. But they started moving the stuff out and now it's just like uh, any old room, I guess. But yeah, and then my room's across the way. But, um, I was thinking about actually filming here just because it's a lot more emptier. And then the light is actually coming through the window and it looks really nice. So I think I might film here and then, I don't know, probably just um, use a chair to film. Move some of this stuff out of the way. I don't know. I haven't thought about where I'm filming yet. But if you guys have any um, opinions on where I should film, let me know. Uh, I was thinking about filming in the dining room, but that echo still is bothering me. Um, I was thinking about filming in the living room. I don't know about that. Um, so yeah, I think that will be my filming room for now. So I'm going to start collecting the stuff right now. Oh yeah, after we went to the dog, dog pound, we actually went to go eat at Teriyaki. That one place I was telling you guys about. And I had Creamer Angels and she had like Gyozi, I think. But um, for the Chinese restaurant I work at, it's called Fried Pot Stickers. So they call it weird things. But um... Yeah, so I'm going to actually film now, so I will catch you guys in a little bit. I just got done filming. Um, it was really easy, but I kept like t I kept redoing every shot. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just got done filming, and that is what this mess is. And 
yeah, I put the mirror right there because every time I film, I need a mirror so I could see if I'm capturing myself. So that's probably why, um, I don't know if you guys have ever noticed that I'm looking like beyond the camera is because I'm looking in the mirror to see if I'm catching myself. Um, so yeah, now I'm about to clean up. Um, I might upload this video and edit it right now. I actually really like filming in here. The lighting was awesome. It looks really good on video. Hopefully, <laughs> I haven't like exported the uh, footage on my computer yet. I like filming here though. And I really like this chair because it was so comfortable. Better than like sitting on the ground. <laughs> um, yeah, it was pretty cool. So now I'm going to edit. Hi guys, I just got done editing this video. It was 15 minutes long, so it's not bad. I thought it was gonna be 20 minutes, but there was like an extra clip that I didn't need in there. It's pretty much done, so I'm happy about that. And let me know what you guys think because it should already be uploaded. I'm gonna try to film tomorrow too because I wanna get, the, get more videos piling up so I don't skip a week. Uh, so yeah, I have work at five. So I'm just going to chill then. I'm probably going to eat before I leave because I'm hungry and there's no food. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's my plan. So I was washing my face, brushing my teeth in the bathroom. And uh, I don't know if you, I haven't told you guys, but my dad's been gone this whole week and he's not returning until Saturday. Um, so it's seriously been me and my three dogs. And... Usually when my dad is here, all three of the dogs, sometimes Snicker sleeps in my bed, uh, but the other two sleep in my dad's bed. And sometimes all three of them sleep in my and sleep in his room on his bed. So they're basically bed dogs. They love the bed. Um, and we let them. Um, so, yeah, uh, I was washing my face and brushing my teeth. I go into my room and... The bigger dog, Nemo, he's really attached to my dad. He doesn't like me. <laughs> well, he does. He likes me, but I mean, like, he's more attached to my dad because my dad's, like, alpha, I guess you could say. And he stays. He loves my dad. He stays in the room and stuff. Um, he's been sleeping with me on the bed, uh, sleeping with me on my bed uh, the past couple nights. And so, um, usually he only jumps on the bed when I'm in the bed. Like when all the dog, when I'm about to sleep, he jumps on the bed. But I go into the room and I find, I find him on my pillows. And this is exactly what he does when my dad, uh, is home and sleeping on his bed. He is laying on my pillows thinking this is his bed. Where am I supposed to sleep, Nemo? <laughs> Where am I supposed to sleep? You're taking everything up. Yeah. Crazy dogs, but he's so adorable. It's just so funny because he never does that. He never has done that before. And all of a sudden, he thinks it's his bed and he can rule everything. He thinks he's the alpha dog, but he's not. Hi, guys. I just got out of school. And I have to do homework. And I'm in my new office. <laughs> I already talked to my dad about, um, cause I was asking him, do you see this? That, that, by the way, that's not mine. That's my stepbrother's. I don't even know where he got that from, but yeah, I'm going to change that later. So don't mind that. But, um, yeah, I asked my dad if he was taking this desk and he said, nope, we're leaving it here. So it's going to be my office <laughs> so it's going to be where I do YouTube videos where I do my homework which I have to do right now guys uh, I'm so hungry I'm about to head to the store right now and get some food buy some food because we need food we don't even have like eggs we don't have the necessities like eggs milk or anything like that so um yeah and I think I might make chicken alfredo to today for lunch um, just so I could have something to eat, but yeah, and then after I come back, I'm going to eat, and then I'm going to uh, film the video, because I've been really, it's weird, I've been in the editing mood for some reason, so I'm going to start editing that today, too, after I'm done shooting it, 
So yeah, I'm gonna be answering your guys' questions, so that should be fun. Came back from store. Um, I spent forty dollars. But yeah, I'm going to make chicken alfredo because I'm actually gonna feed my dog some chicken too. Um, but I got some chai tea. I've been wanting chai tea for the longest time, and it's so good with milk. I think I vlogged it once, other like one other time. It makes me sleep like a baby. It's like really good. Um, but yeah, I just got like basic stuff like eggs and I don't know. You guys can even see that eggs and ramen and chicken that I'm gonna make right now. Um, I got asparagus, avocado. Broccoli for the chicken alfredo. Good thing I don't have to defrost the chicken because it's already defrosted, so that's good. And I think I might save one because there's like four pieces in there. And I only need one piece. Um, I got the Marie calendars again. Dude, seriously, try these. They're amazing. Um, I got this because I love coating the chicken with it. It's so good and it has so much flavor. And you don't even have to season it. Um, of course I got Alfredo sauce. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna start making it now because I'm freaking hungry. So uh, I'll show you guys after I'm done cooking. Just got done cooking. It looks so good and it's so cheesy. Uh, I forgot the potatoes. But it's good though because the potatoes kind of absorbs the sauce or whatever and it sometimes if you overcook it it makes it like really soggy and stuff so yeah it's pretty good I just put broccoli and chicken uh, can't believe I forgot to um, buy potatoes because I was because I like uh, stir fry the potatoes in the morning for breakfast but yeah I'm excited to try it I'm so hungry And it's good. I like it a lot. So I've been going crazy with cooking the past week, uh, just because my dad's been gone. So I went to that grocery. I went to the grocery store and bought food. So I'm like preparing my own food like every day now, and um, I just feel like I need to eat more. Um, I haven't. I've like the beginning of the week. I actually skipped meals because. Uh, I don't know, there was just nothing to eat, and then I was eating McDonald's and all that, and it was just not good, but, um, yeah, I made broccoli, and I just put lemon and salt, and it's so good. I love the lemon, like, I don't know, I just love lemon a lot, and it's really good for you. So, um, yeah, and then I got some chicken, uh, a whole chicken, and I, well, not a whole chicken, but, yeah, um, I just put some French onions on it, and it's so freaking good. Like, yeah, I need to start making more cooking videos because I enjoy cooking. Um, but yeah, I also got my Ulta uh, box today. So I'm going to open that up after I'm done eating. Uh, I forgot to tell you guys that it was supposed to come today. So, yeah, I'm excited to open it up, but I'm going to chow down now. So, excuse me. <laughs> Okay, let's open this. I hope you guys can see me. Okay. I did order something else um, when I was shopping online. I ordered one more thing that I'll show you guys right now. Uh, on the website, they ask you uh, if you want face products, if you want like perfume samples. If you want face product samples, uh, perfume samples, or like a miscellaneous of stuff. So I did the miscellaneous because I don't really care for the perfume. I have too much already. The first one is this Matrix Total Results Heat to Resist Blow Out Tamer. It's Shape Enhancing Gel Heat Protective. Um, that seems pretty cool. They give you a pretty good amount of samples. This is 0.34 fluid ounces. They gave me a Smashbox Camera Ready BB Cream, which I already bought the BB Cream. But this isn't light, so uh, the other one I had is a little bit darker, so I want to see if this is my skin color. Because I've been hating kind of mixing the uh, Smashbox uh, BB Cream with my concealer. Uh, it's just like a pain, so hopefully I think this will be 
really cool. Um, and hopefully it's my skin color because I think I might buy the BB cream if it is my skin color again. So, um, yeah, that's cool. I'm going to try that out. And then I got the Matrix ba uh, Exquisite Oil uh, Shampoo and Conditioner Sample. So that's pretty cool. Whenever you ordered the Lorac Pro Palette, it came with a little sample of the Perfection Mattifying Base Primer. And just, it's pretty little. So, yeah, I'm excited to try this out too because it's oil free, paraben free, and fragrance free. So, that should be cool. And if I like it, I might buy it. Um, I got, this is the, this is the product I was talking about. I got the NYX Wonder Pencil. My stupid camera died. Uh, so yeah, after two hours, I finally got this open. This is the NYX Wonder Pencil in light. And I've been wanting to try this so badly. So yeah, it goes on pretty creamy. Nice. I like it. Let's open the palettes now. Okay, so this is a NYX Love in Paris palette. Let them eat cake. Oh, these are so pretty. Pretty colors. I love this palette. Then I got my Lorac Pro palette. Oh, it does come with the eyeshadow primer. I didn't know that. How do I open this? Oh, this is what it looks like, by the way. Oh, oh my god, it's so pretty. <laughs> wow. I love opening new makeup. Oh, this is gorgeous. Look how, oh my god. Look at these colors, they're so pretty. The top eyeshadows are more of a matte and then the bottom shadows are more of like a shimmer. But uh, this one has like a sheen to it, so that's cute. Oh my god, I'm so excited to try it. I have to Instagram this. Um, and then the little eyeshadow primer. This is the behind the scenes eye primer. So it's really cute. I like it. And oh my god, I'm so excited to use these. They look really pretty. Yep, good purchase. Hopefully they turn out to really good. Um, and hopefully I didn't waste my money, but I'm so excited. <laughs> So yeah, um, if you guys want tutorials on it, be sure to leave a comment down below or like this vlog and I will start doing tutorials for you guys because I'm excited to try the, out the palette. I'm going to start playing with the colors maybe tomorrow um, and yeah, this is going to be so awesome. So uh, yeah, let me know and I will do one. Okay, so the next food I made are quesadillas. <laughs> um... Obviously, they're just hella simple. I don't go so fancy with quesadillas. I just put cheese and chicken and put it in a tortilla. But yeah, they're hella good. And I wish I had the sauce from Taco Bell, that orange sauce that they put in their quesadillas. Because this would taste like a hundred times better. But yeah, just simp. I just got done putting my whole face on. <laughs> All I gotta do is do my hair and get dressed. But... Um, I did use the Lorac Pro palette. Uh, once I try out the colors, I will do a tutorial for you guys. But, um, yeah, I just did a simple eye today just because I wasn't really going anywhere. I'm just going to work. And I didn't really want to dramatic it up. Okay, I got this. <laughs> 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 what? Ha 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 ha!